do you want a wireless plug socket? Today I'm going to show you how to turn on some appliances and lights in your house completely remotely from your phone. Yes, that is correct. Today we're looking at the Hussor Smart Socket. As the name implies, this is a smart socket. You can put it anywhere around your house, you can turn it off and on using your phone. And in this video I'm going to explain how you can use it and what the app includes and how simple it is to install and start using. So first you've got to plug it into a wall. It has a socket pass through which means it has a female plug socket on the front so you can plug your plug in and it has a male plug socket on the back so you can plug it into a wall outlet. Now you need to scan the QR code in the leaflet included in the box and download the smart home app. Once you load the app onto your smartphone you need to connect your home's Wi-Fi and then you want to connect the plug to a wall socket and just turn that plug on from the mains outlet of the plug. Now it will automatically connect to your Wi-Fi and then you can start pairing onto your phone. It should have automatically paired by now. It's that simple, you don't need to touch anything. As soon as it touches your Wi-Fi network it will get onto your phone and then you can control it from there. So when is this Wi-Fi plug socket useful? I personally found it useful because I normally leave like this green light on when I go to bed so I can just turn it straight off on my phone. That's what it's been for most of the time. I have had it once as my laptop charger Sometimes I just leave it charging overnight and my battery can drain a bit in that way. So I turn it off by using the Wi-Fi smart socket. Tap a button on my phone, it will go off. And I don't have to worry about my night about my battery and my laptop slowly draining. So let's get into the app. Once you're in the app, you get a list of the wireless sockets in your house. I only have one here. So I'll click on the green lamp, which I named because it's a green lamp. And then I'll come up with a button. You can press this. If it's grey, it'll go to red, that means it's on. If it's red and it goes to grey, that means it's off. It's quite self-explanatory. That's how simple it is. There are other tabs at the bottom. Let's cover them. Next up is the power usage tab. Here you can see how much energy your wall socket is draining, like in kilowatt hours or watts. That's cool. I believe it's just that plug socket. I think if you have more than one setup, there'll be a new tab on the main home screen of the app where you can control all the sockets and see what power they're using. But this is just for this socket once you dive into the power usage inside your actual socket. As you can see, these sockets actually use quite low power because they're transmitting Wi Fi, they're sending power through the socket and then they're connecting back to your Wi Fi router, also connected to the Wi Fi on your phone. So it's quite low power outage for such a smart device. You can also add a timer. So, say you could use this for like a microwave. So, if you go out and then you come home at like 5 o'clock, and you want your tea to be like heated up in a microwave. I've never actually tried microwavable food, but a lot of people say it's quite cool. So say if you had like a microwavable food, you put it in a microwave, you could tell the microwave to turn on before you get home, and as soon as you get home from work, you can eat your meal, it'll all be cooked, and you won't have to touch anything, it'll do it automatically from its programmable chip inside of the smart socket. So you guys, a massive thank you to Husor for setting this out for review. I'll drop a link down below, 